Hi guys, what's up? And hope you all are doing well today. And this video is about how to get a good BM without an artifacts, and also how to get an XP fast or the trick on or in getting an experience or XP faster. Also about uh, this video is about the heirloom as well on how to build a good heirloom for your um, blade master. Okay, so first is. Let me show you my tune here, this one. So first is you are you or you need or you are required to get a decent race, and I call a nobility or a house a race because it's typically the same guys. So let's just call it race <laughs> for the sake of um, tutorial. T tutorial, anyways. Um, you are required to get a decent race and also. Also a bloodline, right? A good bloodline. I mean, um, bloodline percentage, and this is the um, let's say race. So why why is that? Is because um, let's click on how nobility. You can click on how nobility. It's because of their um, stats parameter or or also known as the potential. So the potential of how nobility is you will give uh, it will give more on ag dex and strength. So that's their potential or their build up on their attributes right um here's the potential you can also click that and just to read it okay so the higher potentials of the attribute the more progress when upgrading so what i understand about the upgrading is when you level up your character right so this is level one so when i level up my character with these potentials double a and b and also there's a b on per but we're not going to doesn't we, we don't we don't care if we have a, a b per because it's going to be a a blade master so a blade master we only need um three stats on to increase on our blade master that's strength dex and agi and a little bit to the vitality okay guys so again <laughs> um let me just go back on what i am saying earlier um this guy is level one right so naturally when i level up to level two or higher um it will give more on my give it, it will give more stats on my um, Dex and AG since it's an A, right? So, just <laughs> just saying it, guys. Cause it's it's I don't need to say it. It's prob probably a common um common thing, right? It's an common thing. It's uh what you call that um common knowledge in the game, right? So, anyways, so that's why we need a good job. I I mean, a good race for the job for the job of Blade Master. Cause if you have like let's say, do I have um let's say this one <laughs> um what's is his a uh, high high elf right so let's not this just another ra pure uh race like pelfin no other mixed uh bloodline okay so pelfin doesn't have um an agi so it's bad for the job or the blade master job so let's click on house pelfin and it says uh, the potential is dex per and strength so pelfin is better on the other job like mm, shadow blader i think it's, it's called shadow blader because you need uh, the shadow blader needs per um dex and strength so that's mainly the shadow bladers um attributes so that's why we need um a race for the job okay and a good a good bloodline percentage so let's go back to the guy or that tune um oh by the way guys um House signing is also a good um, race to get a a good a, a good blade master. Like C is good, but it's preferably you need an A a, a B. So like you need like B on these three parameters here or stats here. Like all you need on your blade master is um three stats, right? That's primar primarily the strength dex and ag so especially the ag guys so you need at least a b on their potential on strength a b on dex and a b or higher on the ag since you <laughs> that's why you need a blade master because of their ag so in order to deflect more damage and a little bit on vitality so overall signing um i have a signing here <laughs> i i mean this one so overall signing would be also better to for the job of blade master i just tried the hon nobility guys because it i have another purpose on hon nobility it 
it's <laughs> still an experimental but if you just really need a blade master the signing bloodline is i would say perfect for the job because it, it their um, vitality is higher than Hon nobility and the aji well they can have a b on their um potential even if you click your <laughs> and this is a hundred percent signing right if even if the potential says <laughs> it doesn't have an aji the signing has an aji build right so the potential is strength dex and vitality that's the three fo focus on signing but as you can see <laughs> you will be given an aji so it's high that's b it's high enough to be a good blade master and also i just let's just i just want to show you guys um the other like this one is um 60 percent and it also it already has a b on the edgy so it's it's really good guys the hasani you don't really need the how nobility like i'm trying to show you here that this is just an, my example this guy here or this stone so you don't really need to get um a hand nobility like i do because this is just my example okay <laughs> this guy here because i'm about to use this guy later on on my experiment so i haven't used him still um is already to age 25 and still level one so anyways let's continue guys so that's what you need on basically what you need on blade master let me just um summarize it so you need a, a potential of b on strength b on dex b on agi and a little bit to wait a little bit on vitality right like c or d is good but c is better or higher so anyways you just 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 get up just <laughs> that i think this is a bad example this on hon ability or hon race let's just go to um like this one <laughs> it fails to have a uh, a good agi like you really need a b on agi on um building you building a blade master so 70 percent um bloodline um house signing and doesn't have an a b on agi so you need a b um that's the short uh that's the um average requirement for building a good uh blade master guys okay so you need a b so probably let's go stick on signing okay since signing has a better stats on wit and good strength and good decks so and also they will add sometimes they will give you a good agi i think i have wait wait let's me just b b a oh that's a ability i'll sign it never mind guys never mind guys <laughs> okay i think i made my point right i think i made my point uh, let's just one more time one more reason okay 60 percent 60 percent bloodline percentage and it already has a b i think guys the um the ladies on signing will have more agi than the boys or the yes the boys the male like like the like the earlier earlier like is this the one earlier like my example earlier where's that guy there's a c on agi um i think this guy yeah this guy right so 70 percent um deadline percentage and uh, this guy has a d rather than a b because probably is because he's a male or like i read it one time on some fandom or i think wiki that male will have more on strength and less on agi or dex and women or the female would have more um potential on agi and dex that's why probably this explain it <laughs> the 100 percent bloodline on house signing and and double s on dex and a b on the agi because maybe because of course the wiki is correct that uh, the female would be much more agile than the the male is much more um, stronger than me uh, but slower uh, than female okay so that's just i'm just clearing it up guys so but there's no okay i'm finally battery slow so let's get let get this done i think i have explained the job pretty well on what to get what job you need or requirement of the job of the blood uh, of the blade master and the uh, um percentage 
of the bloodline since it's important to increase um when you inc uh when your bloodline increases higher or like 60 to 70 or 100 um it i already said that right oh, never mind <laughs> never mind guys i think i'm done explaining the job so let's move on to the um attributes or the heirloom okay guys <laughs> 